Hi, I know there's a, a lot of back orders for lots of people and lots of you are actually adding them all up to see what the total is. And you've been saying it takes a long time now to add up all of the different orders that are on back order. So a quick way of doing it, I'm going to show you now, is go onto your back order page, scroll to the bottom, so you make sure you're right to the bottom, and then left click and then drag your mouse and highlight all of the back orders. So just keep going up until you see the top. Right, you're up to the top now. So you've got everything highlighted. Just right click and click copy or you can use Control C on the keyboard. Then you need to go to an Excel spreadsheet and either use Control V or right click and click paste then that will paste all of your back orders there you're not interested in any of the other columns only the price so just highlight those columns click at the top there drag across till it's highlighted then click edit delete and then do the same for the other columns and then edit delete and now you should be left with just the prices uh, that won't add it up as it is there so one more thing to do all you need to do now is go to edit and then find and then go to replace and then you just need to type in the pound sign I've already got it there and then what you need to put in that replace with just put a, a space just click your space bar and you've got a space in there and then click replace all and that's done 98 replacements click OK close that down and now you see there's no pound sign there and those are numbers so what you can do is highlight all of those numbers just drag your mouse down and then somewhere it's just off the screen here it shows my total is £842.50. You should see the sum will be somewhere on your Excel spreadsheet. But another way of doing it, if you just click in uh, one of the cells there and then look for that sign there. Just click Auto Sum. That will highlight all of those columns, all of that column, and then just press the Enter key and there is the total and so it's 842 so that's a quick way of adding up all your back orders hopefully in the next week or two you won't need to be doing this because all of the products will be in stock and we'll be back to normal okay hope that helps bye now